Hi, today we're going to talk about um, traveling with kids and feeding them on the road. <clears throat> my family's about to leave for a, not my family, me and the kids are about to leave for about 10 days visiting a family, my extended family, my sisters and brothers in another state. And we have about a three to four hour road trip in front of us. And I'm not big on side of the road stops because they're just filled with a million temptations that everybody wants but nobody really should eat. So I try to do as much as I can in the car. And I learned the hard way with three little kids, you can't just pack one cooler because you're constantly, no matter how long you're in the car, giving kids stuff. So what I do is I have an individual lunch bag, see, cute little eco girl lunch bag, and an individual water bottle for each kid. I pack them just like they're going to school. I do a sandwich, I do two or three snacks, some fruit, some things that are healthy, but then also fun. There's a couple, maybe a cookie and some pretzels and things that they like too. And then they get that and they bring it in the car with them and they each have their own little bag of activities that they pack and then they're good for the car ride and they can eat it all as soon as they sit down or they can space it out for the whole trip. And for the most part, they're usually empty by the time we get there, but they've learned the art of self-control. We definitely have had a few trips where they ate everything in the first 10 seconds and then they were starving for the rest of the trip. So they've realized over time that you have to space it out and eat it like, you know, in intervals and not just sit down at, you know, eight in the morning and eat your entire day's worth of meals, which has happened a couple times. So it seems to keep me sane. It keeps them sane. It keeps the car ride a little more peaceful and I'm not constantly turning around and trying to chuck food back into the back of the minivan. Um, and they're healthy. They're not eating fast food and they're not eating yuck on the side of the road. If you have to stop, the big rest stops that have the convenience stores are usually the best because you might be able to get a piece of fresh fruit or you might just be able to get some low salt pretzels or something a little bit more, um, a little bit more healthy or maybe some mixed nuts or something than, you know, a burger and fries. So these are my healthy uh, tips for taking kids on the road and for everybody that's got um, travels and, and road trips this summer with your family. Happy and safe travels. Bye.